Some scary moments for an East Metro tow truck driver during our wintry weekend on the roads, and it was all caught on MnDOT traffic cameras. As our Paul Bloom tells us tonight, the tow truck driver lucky to walk away with only minor bumps and bruises. Watch this scary video. We will slow it down here as a tow truck driver has just pulled that white van out of the I 35E ditch in Egan. He is on the driver's side when an SUV comes skidding across a lane of freeway traffic and slams into the van. The tow truck op with Dix Valley Service is thrown flat into the snow. Third medic, so we just spun out and hit the car that just got pulled out. Uh, tow driver is on the other side. Yes, so he's very lucky. Neelan Thompson is the safety manager with Dix and describes the call as the worst imaginable in his role. Fortunately, the 30-year-old tow truck driver is suffering only some minor bumps and bruises following a trip to the hospital. He is expected back at work by the end of the week, but said he wasn't ready to talk about this closest of calls. It's a lot of mass. There's a lot of mass in motion there, a lot of movement. Cars weigh anywhere between 33,000 and 7,000 pounds. And when they're doing 65, 70 miles an hour or so, or even 40 miles an hour, and you're a pedestrian with a traffic vest on, some gloves, maybe a hat and boots, you don't stand a chance. Adding to the trauma of everything that happened Sunday morning to the team here at Dix, not only is the truck driver shaken up, but so too a member of the dispatch team. She was actually on the phone with him when he was hit. They're like five miles from where you're going. One minute they're talking to our uh, driver and the next minute he's not talking to our driver because he was hit and then her next phone call is the state patrol telling her that our driver's been hit. Neelan describes the dispatch center as extended family for the tow truck drivers, often their eyes and ears while monitoring MnDOT freeway cameras across the southeast metro. Neelan's now hoping that the video of this near tragedy gets other motorists to slow down and pay attention to wintry road conditions, especially when tow crews or emergency responders are working along the side of the road, like Sunday morning on an apparently slick 35E. In this case, the motorist cited for a failure to drive with due care. Paul Bloom, Fox 9.